here is a case of accidental renal vein injury during partial nephrectomy how we controlled any venous bleeding is dangerous see this is the fat i was dissecting with the suction two veins big veins were there you can see the same caliber vein this fat see when i went inside see the tip of the harmonic has touched the vein and perforated that it is a only touch because vein is very thin these accidents are never expected so unexpectedly when it happens this is a unedited video stretch first like this so by stretching see where it is bleeding we can identify in a soft clamp like this you close it you close it. nothing will happen in the vein after that i got little breathing time but again it bled so because uh, it's a vein uh, it usually doesn't stop because it does not retract it does not go into spasm and it will continuously bleed see this this pressing with the non traumatic forceps is the key in controlling the bleeding and uh, avoiding the mor morbidity and mortality of bleeding somehow that instrument has to press and slowly now on the lateral border see the uh, traction with suction is helping then i am holding then i can see now i am ready with the clip it's a small opening there is no need to worry now i have taken the metal clip fast and applied on this side during this time around 50 ml will go but metal clip is less traumatic 5 ml metal clip this is now i am continuously keeping under stretch now another metal will clip will come this is only to approximate the edges later on these metal clips 5 mm can be removed they are very atraumatic and after that you can take nicely stitch with proline if you want see second one i kept and third one i am keeping on the top this will occlude half of the lumen only honestly or you can reduce that also by putting periphery see now it is close that is over now you suck out all the blood wait for some time see what happened raise little bit of uh, intra abdominal pressure take a breathing time and alert the anesthetist and whether we can do partial nephrectomy or not we have to think the only thing is big vein was there by the side of the vein very big vein similar of this size big vein was there see large vein is there this is the vein and next is one more vein is there so we can sacrifice this vein is our feeling in stuff repair but what we thought we will mobilize the kidney first we'll leave it here see my metal clips half has controlled 90% of the bleeding i can wait and take the action either if it is a single vein we might have gone see now i am removing the fat carefully now my hands are little slow actually this happened because outside one retractor was there two retractors were there for the liver that has given resistance usually this don't happen with suction because it is blunt it can happen with maryland it can happen with harmonic their their tips are very always wash washing will help to uh, for the better coagulation of the approximated edges and removing the and light uh, absorption will not be there now see everything is under control second vein is there very big vein now what i did is i applied distal clip then i removed the one one clip you see here you can easily remove the clips uh, Uh, see in between two clips i have applied the because i am sacrificing here my job is to come out safely even if whether i can do partial nephrectomy sometimes or not is doubtful such a big vein is there which can drain easily almost like a one renal vein the another vein is there so now what i removed with maryland just hold them and pluck out easily they will come like this easily they will come like this they are non traumatic you can to take the proline stitches also but in this case i did not take chance because of the second vein now one more clip i am applying two sides because already one thing happened don't take chance nicely my assistant has applied um, here your assistant also should be good see slowly now my movements have done very very slow and already it is uh, behind the artery is there we have seen that artery so you should be careful that when you are planning for partial nephrectomy artery should not be clipped and uh, see now everything is under control now other vein is nicely draining and kidney is not congested 
uh, we have visualized the entire parenchyma. I am making space, taking time, carefully analyzing how many clips can be applied. Now applied one more clip at the uh, above so that we can proceed with the partial nephrectomy. We proceeded with partial nephrectomy successfully with Vami's KMA time of 48 minutes. Now these are the uh, 10 mm clips which are coming from the uh, Satinsky clip uh, for the partial nephrectomy. That is the advantage I have taken. Now this is over. This is over. After that be careful. See we can see the artery and vein almost like a normal artery and vein. Post operatively the venous drainage is very good and patient did well post operatively. To summarize any venous bleeding primary aim is to bring the edges approximation quickly by compressing first by putting the gauge piece then by holding with a um, Alice type of forceps or Maryland of forceps and apply metal clips short metal clips quickly on the edge then take breathing time and then proceed. Thank you.